Veterinary technician training is a growing field. The demand for this profession is expected to increase 19% in the next few years. Pet owners have come to expect high-level services for family pets. And around the country, veterinary technicians assist veterinarians in providing highly technical medical care. There are some differences between a veterinarian and a veterinary technician. A veterinarian spends about eight years going to school and becomes a doctor of veterinary medicine. A veterinary technician spends approximately two years and obtains an Associate of Applied Science degree. And a veterinary technician can do many things that a veterinarian can also do, but we cannot prescribe medication, we can't perform surgery, and we can't diagnose. Veterinary technician students have a wide variety of backgrounds. But one thing they do have in common is they all have a love or a passion for animals and feel strongly about helping animals because they are patients that can't speak for themselves. Once they begin their veterinary technician program, they are also going to learn that they need to have a love of science as well. I think most veterinary technician students who enter the field probably have a vision to work in a small animal practice with dogs and cats. But once they start taking classes, they realize that this field is vast, that there's so many opportunities, not just with dogs and cats, but veterinary teaching hospitals, in an equine facility, doing research, working for animal shelters, zoos, wildlife. The opportunities for a veterinary technician are endless. Well, veterinary technology, and veterinary technicians in particular, it's, it's a relatively new concept, you know, in, in just about the last 50 years. In the 1960s, we, we saw colleges and, and schools for veterinary technicians uh, crop up throughout the United States. And I, I think that the newer generation of veterinarians realize the tremendous worth and importance of veterinary technicians, trained, certified veterinary technicians in their hospital. Gone are the days where you just had, bring Jimmy in here to hold the dog. You know, and now we have people that have been trained in, in taking good radiographs and, and the different specialties, running anesthesia, dentistry, uh, and, and doing all the different specialties that we do every day. I'm amazed, and you know, in the, the 35 years, 36 years I've been out, we have CAT scans and MRIs, ultrasound, we have oncology and, and chemotherapy for the pets. Veterinary medicine is a team sport. You can't do it by yourself, and you can't do it without help. And the technicians are right there. Veterinary technician training involves a wide variety of classes. Classes that include lab work, as well as pharmacology and radiology, anesthesia, large animal medicine, laboratory animal medicine, avian and reptile. Students are prepared to work with many animal species and perform various duties throughout the day. It is important that pet owners everywhere have access to good care for their animals. There is a pronounced shortage of vet techs around the country. Institutions are doing their best to educate passionate students and get them ready for the field. I would definitely recommend anyone who would like to get into this field to go to a vet tech school because the education is priceless. The things that I learned while going to vet tech school were what set me up for success in the field today. If you love animals and want to become a veterinary technician, your future begins at Bell Ray Institute. Located in beautiful Denver, Colorado, Bell Ray Institute of Animal Technology is one of the oldest and largest veterinary technician schools in the United States. Since the program's launch in 1971, over 6,000 students have earned an Associate of Applied Science degree in veterinary technology through Bell Ray. Our goal at Bell Ray is to ensure that our veterinary technician graduates are prepared to jump into the field of veterinary technology. And we do that by offering classroom work as well as many hands-on opportunities. Our students do off-campus labs working with a variety of animal species. They work with various local animal shelters. In the seventh quarter of schooling here, they do a course called preclinical and that is completely hands-on where we spay and neuter animals for a local animal shelter. In addition to that, they will go on to a 10-week internship program. They get to choose from approximately 200 internship sites. During the two-year training at Bell Ray Institute, aspiring veterinary technicians not only learn the ins and outs of working with all sorts of animals, but also how they can make a difference by providing compassionate and excellent veterinary medical care. 
Staying up with new technology and research, Bell Ray Institute continues to grow, filling the need for vet techs and supporting vet teams with productive new professionals with a diverse skill set. The skills that they use can be so broad. There are so many opportunities now for young people in veterinary medicine, and particularly in veterinary technology. I've taken veterinary technicians with me to the North Pole to pull blood in, in, in polar bears, uh, to the South Pole to look at uh, plastic ingestion in penguins, and the technicians are right there with me to help restrain the animals so they don't get hurt, and also to grab valuable lab work that we, we, we need for our research. There is a definite need for vet techs out there. Nowadays, a lot of hospitals require you to become certified and go through school. I would definitely recommend Bell Ray to any students who would like to become a vet tech. And I was able to go into emergency medicine straight out of school as a graduate, and it just wouldn't have been the same without the education that I received. The future looks bright for veterinary technicians. It's an exciting field to be in at this time. The Department of Labor consistently rates this uh, field as one that's gonna be continuing to grow, even as the economy may waver. We have 100 plus job openings right now in the Denver metro area, so we have more jobs than technicians. And really, in this field, the sky is the limit. Our mission at Bell Ray is to train veterinary technicians to succeed in the field, but most importantly, to make a difference in the lives of animals. To learn more, visit us online at bellray.edu.